All right guys, so to celebrate the store expansion and the shop update and everything we've done, we decided to give away this 429 Shoker. So we're gonna have the option, either the motor or we're gonna give away $5,000 of store credit. So we're gonna have keychains, stickers, hat, lanyards, and of course our shirts. And we are so, this, this same month of July, we're gonna drop a new logo, a new shirt, a new, new design. We also have uh, the windshield banners. Uh, a couple things, it's at uh, shopvelocityracing.com. And every, so every week we're gonna change it up. So let's say one week we're gonna have, the sticker's gonna give you five entries, a keychain, two entries, a hat one, and the shirt 10. And then the next week we're gonna switch it. So just to keep it interesting, uh, every week we, we'll, we'll switch it up. Um, anything you buy from that website is gonna enter you to this 429, or like I said, $5,000 store credit. That's as of now, the credit might go up, or might go down to zero. <laughs> or maybe you owe me money. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kidding. But from the 1st of July to July 31st, is when you get entered the giveaway the 31st is the deadline whether whatever the case is somebody's taking home this motor or five thousand dollar credit as of now check it out shopvelocityracing.com <music> this is gonna fall away <laughs> We're finally back working. As y'all can hopefully see, we've cleaned up the shop very well. We got rid of 75, 80 percent of shit laying around here. It makes a big difference. It makes the shop look cleaner, more organized. We know everything's at. Not before we had to like look for it for a little bit. But yeah, we have all our transmission stuff on that little case. This is a bench. I'm about to cut this cross member up. We're working on uh, on the gases uh, giveaway truck. We're gonna pull the motor, clean it up, cam kit, and gears. Oh, they're gonna do like the basic typical cam Silverado setup. So I'm working on a TS100 cross member and uh, we're gonna get turbos mounted on Lonzo's uh, F150 today. So we already maxed out the previous turbos on the F150s. We already maxed out the ones we have now. So his is gonna be the next step up. His is getting bigger turbos than like the King Ranch and the other trucks we've done. The only thing that he's in Colorado, so the DA over there is horrible. In case it don't spill him, we're gonna have to probably add a little nitro or something just to get it, get it to, to spool up. But it should spool up here fine. He's gonna have a 400, so he's gonna have internal, external dump valves, so that should help it on the spool up. And in a bit, I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk y'all through the store. We haven't made a video in a while just because we've been busy with the store and the shop. I'm gonna walk y'all through the store and show y'all like the, the, the remodel, I guess, or the expansion. All right, guys, so now we're back in the store, and as you can tell, this is what happened in the last couple of weeks. So we redid the whole shop, cleaned it up, and then we kind of expanded a lot. So. I guess this hood used to be right here. This used to be the wall. If you ever came in here, this was the wall where the fittings were. This is what stand right here. So now we got the other half, knocked the wall down, and now we have a lot more space. So now we can actually move around. Now we have more room to put stuff. Uh, one of the first things that got here after we expanded was uh, we got Caltrack now for like the OBS, Flipkin, non Flipkin, the Serato F-150. If y'all have, if y'all need it, move some for any other vehicle just let us know we could get them for you um, we have more ffre short blocks coming in we're actually out we only had a stock peyote in right now so this coming week we have three of them coming in uh, ls blocks we're getting some as well this is, and you can tell the converter wall we're trying to we just restock that so we also have some whipples coming in for the 18 to 20s 21 and plus uh, we have a couple kits coming in the stage two so um, we could get those shipped out, picked up, or and or installed. As usual, we always carry our cam kits, the DOD deletes, all engine components, ARP studs, head gaskets, head bolts, whatever you you need to uh, put your headlights together. And we also have section for the Coyote. So we also have head gaskets for the Coyote. We have the ARP head studs, and then we have like your cam bolts, the ARP uh, cam bolts for cam towers. We always had uh, wall bar 450, 525 fuel pumps. Uh, ID injectors, fuel injector connection, and now we're gonna get the automotive like for the big setup, the 5.0, 7.0s, 10.0s pumps coming in. So as we go, and especially now since we have more room, we're gonna get a lot more inventory uh, for you guys to be more accessible for your builds or whatever you guys need, uh, whether it's picked up or shipped. The wheels and tires from what they used to be in the way when you walked in here, now they got the little corner for them. So this is all our radios, slicks, front runners, uh, more in the little bit in the back. So we'll carry the locks if you get for the guys that don't know for Mustangs, Corvettes, F-150s. Uh, this is a friend F-150. Uh, that's what I'm saying. Uh, <laughs> and then we got some more F-150 locks up there. We got welds back there. We do have race stars. They're not here right now. They're down there. And then the storage. We got a lot of stuff. So guys, so whatever you always um, have any questions on, y'all can give us a call at our shop. 832-322-4747. 
shoot us a DM, a Facebook message. We'll do, we'll do our best to try to get back to you guys. So that's pretty much it. We got the new lighting, painted the whole roof tiles black, painted the walls gray. It used to be black, blue, red. Spider-Man. Yeah, it looked like, look like McDonald's in here. <laughs> Hey, it's left it at. I wanna hear the smack. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, burger. Well, there you have it. Now it's gonna look about right. Finally, it's gonna look solid. It's gonna look perfect. I need a swivel. Come get it, bro. Fuck you. <laughs> Brother man over here, he knows this big old monster dinosaur is not gonna fix the damn drive bullshit. That's why he's laughing. Alright, what's the swivel Steve? Everyone threw it in there. Everyone, why'd you throw a swivel in there? I didn't there? throw it in there, bro. Why'd you throw it in there? Try to burn me. Look at him. Now he's gotta go to the washing unit. <laughs> Well, if I can sit here and tell you, man, in a vulgar way, it wouldn't be nice, man. But it's hot. That's like 112. Oh, man, that's all we had to do this whole time? Yeah. They fucking kicked their ass. Are you showing your vape chicks? Showing your vape. Hey, nigga, be having a fruity ass colored look. Down. Yeah, I think we're gonna do positive gears. So yeah, so you can do burnouts on this thing. Quick. Oh, you just better fly out. Good. That's how you know she's bottomed out. We're waiting on Steve. <laughs> brother man right here. Keep her going. Keep her going. Keep her going. Con este frío que trae ahorita. Vamos, vamos. Ahora mete la cabeza ahí, Poncho. Mira, tócala. Está con mis huevos cuando salgo el taller. Sí, para vivir sin bajar. Te corto las sandías, pero me vale madre. Yo sí. ¿Tú sí? Ah, pues córtala tú, no. si tú sabes. Yo sí pensé que sabía, pero no sé. <risa> <risa> Borra eso, güey. Es no te pases de verga, güey. Ah, ¿Sabes cortarla tú, güey? ¡Vivis! ¿Vos qué es? Perfecto. It's almost done. It's almost done. Motor's in already. Should turn on. It should turn on tomorrow morning. Maybe tonight. Some super light. Alright, so I'm trying to finish the truck before everyone gets here. He went to O'Reilly's, which is like two minutes, three minutes away from here. So I'm trying to finish it, do the most I can. So when he comes back, he can see how slow he is to go get stuff. Yeah, 
I'm in the wild, wild west with it. Uh, two bad hoes, they don't question shit. Great A smoker ain't tasting it. Uh, uh, I got a lot on my plate, but I swear ain't no check and split. I pay What? What? A la verga, este batido puso todo. Caliente. ¿Qué opinas? Sí, claro. Máquina comada. No se le ha olvidado como lo enseñé. <risa> But I guess she live and you learn from all your mistakes. Pops did 15 years in the state. Came home, got flown out of the state. Turn up the crib and got mama a place. I'm getting money, I'm proud of the cake. Turn Should go today to the exhaust shop and uh, hopefully Lewis gets to tune in today and be ready for pickup today. So we got the ways to get on here. This is a, something new we try on these trucks. So we ran the 64s, Precision 68s. Now we're trying 72s. Uh, so we did a couple things to the motor that should spool it. It does have a TS400 internal external dump valve, so it should spool it. It not spool as fast as the 68 or 64, but I believe it should spool it and the truck should make a lot more power. I think on the other truck we kind of found the limit on those turbos as well. This is a 7275. This is a 6870 that we usually run. This one has the same uh, motor as a King Ranch, except this one has Frankenstein. So it's a FFRE short block sleeves and O-ring. So we do carry those in stock. Uh, 